What is up, everybody? Here we are today with a credit blitz sponsored by Tib Troopin today. Uh, we're going to be doing a McBorker deck. So it's going to be McNeil Borker. This deck is very heavily invested in air. I probably wouldn't play the Razorback if I was doing Borker. I'd probably play like a different unit, uh, like a cheaper unit in a different building. Probably like another War Factory unit and just use Borker as my late game. But this is the deck he's offered us. He actually offered me a bunch of McNeil decks. Um, this is not the best one. There, there were definitely better ones that I was considering playing. But I decided not to play just the best deck because I thought that'd be a bit boring. Um, there's also some... There was a pretty wild triple War Factory, triple air. But I thought it was going to be way too expensive. Because everything costs like 60 or more. Uh, so we're going to play this one. And we'll see how it goes. Two, one. New objective available. Alright, so we're going to go rifles first. Obviously. Those dogs. There's harvester up here. We'll get missile rifle. We'll just chill for now. Alright, that's fine. We'll get the uh, we'll get the focus fire on this dog squad. Probably just gonna go pitbull here. Pump jet trooper. Wanna keep these away from our pitbull, obviously. MG, oh dear. Uh, we guess we should go razor barrack, although we're not that close enough. Razor barrack. Oh, where are my rifles going? What the heck? Yeah, I don't understand what my rifles thought they were doing there. Need to keep these dogs off the pad. We'll give the rifles enough time to kill the jump jets. All right, nice. We did that. We need to hold this tile so the rifles can get onto the pad. Other MG. All right, we definitely want Razorback now. I'm just going to try and clean up these two MGs with the Razorback. One. There goes the Talon. It was the second MG. Alright, we're really far ahead now. We have a hammerhead as well, right? So we'll just get a hammerhead here. Clean up both of these. I'm actually going to trap the uh, Orca. I thought the Orca was going to run away, to be honest with you, but it didn't. Um, we'll get some missiles. Ooh, raise it back. Bad raise it back. Need pop cap here for more missiles, really. Maybe I might just make a balker actually. Yeah, I'm just gonna make a balker to clean up all these dogs. And we'll just hide behind the missiles. Wow, four pit bulls. Crazy. The second balker. He's actually just killing my missiles with pit bulls, which is kind of insane. I ain't kind of in my hammerhead, but that's not on a pad, so I super don't care. <laughs> Alright, GG, my dude. Alright, Pablo. A one half. What building he has barracks, okay. Get a second rifleman because we already know he has a barracks. Drop trooper. Oh, we'll set up the rifles on defensive concave. We should lose this fight just, but the rifles, even both rifle squads, is like half the price of the shock trooper. Even if we lose a third rifle, we're still <laughs> equal cost with the shock trooper. Let's lose four before it's a bad trade, pretty much. I should lose more than four because four is a bad trade. But we actually traded there for slightly, like we're up a very tiny amount. Anyway, we're just going to go straight into Razorback. He spent 80 on shocks and I spent 50 on rifles. So we're still up a lot on cost. And we're going to immediately make missiles to follow up the Razorback. This is classic Razorback play. We just go Razorback plus missiles. Launched. 
Wow, a Wolverine. Okay, why not? Why not? Building online. Unit ready. Razorback ready to stray. People ready to fight. Blast them. Right over there, miss out. Gonna rifle down. Gonna have to Defense trap down this Wolverine as well. The Titan? You get the Titan in the trap at the same time. I actually meant to have the pit bull come down and not the rifles. Oh, that didn't work out great. Then I just end up suiciding my rifles. We'll borker, borker this, uh, this Titan. Bring up some missile crew. That's so many tech units already. That's so many. Ah, tech is dumb. Really dumb. Alright, let's see if we can bomb these damage. No, pretty much none at all. Crap this Wolverine. Hopefully buy enough time to kill it or kill something. No, it's not looking great. Not looking great at all. Right, we need to bomb this Titan to death and hopefully not lose our Balker immediately. Yeah, I'm not sure what to do about this Titan, to be honest. Kind of indestructible with the uh, Liang drone. Oh, oh, just fired the missile. Alright, cool. I don't know how I won that game, but I did. Ooh. Objective available. Right, up against Bully. He's just walking past my rifles. Okay. I'll probably win this fight. Double half. No, one half. Wow, he actually. What? 26 second harvester? All right, I don't understand. Um, yeah. I forgot what was in my wall. Oh, in my air tower. I seems not that invested in winning. Defense online. Strafing targets. Nuclear weapon launch. Hey then. Unit ready. I think it's safe to assume that he's super invested in killing my harvester though. <laughs> I think we're probably going to win this one. Feeling pretty good about our chances at the moment. Walker should come in and just kill everything. Oh. Hawk is still pretty good against bikes because they're free man. You are victorious. Three, two, one. New objective received. Unit ready. Wagon playing Solomon. Bet we will see many, many tech units in this. Harvester ready. I'll play this stupid dancing on and off the pads game. Rifleman awaiting unit moving out. Unit ready. I go for a third rifleman here. Report rifleman ready. 
All right, got a line of riflemen. See what he goes now. It's almost certainly going to be like a talon. So I'm actually going to break, make a pit bull preemptively. Yeah. <laughs> Put this trap down. Didn't mean to have the people go forwards there. I'm supposed to come back. Just clicked it. I'm guessing this is going for my harvester. No, it's not. Insane. Snipers, all right, let's get razor back. Iron cannon just for my razor back. Right, fair enough, razor back down. Make a new razor back. For a trap down here as well, so we don't lose the razor back to missiles. So we're gonna lose the race back to missiles anyway. Just bad. Nope, we did save it. Nice. A lot of talons coming out. We're gonna need some missiles and pit bulls. Beats. Good beats. Good iron cannon. Oh, so close. Almost flipped it. Major structural damage received. Unit ready. Razorback ready for a flyby. Defense online. Give me my wingman. I'm able to rip them up to the danger zone. Unit lost. Splash that sucker. Let's give him the bird. Unit ready. I really feel like McNeil is actually just uh, bad. It always seems really underwhelming. Walker. You know he's going to iron cannon near the end of the missile as well. Probably iron cannon the Walker, in fact. This is, I think, the best thing Kraft does. Blocking units from getting to pads near the end of the missile. There's the iron cannon, but it's too late. Alright, cool. Mission accomplished. Okay, last game up against Snap. And Jade. Got here, we got a harvester and nothing else yet. Double harvester, excellent. A double rifle. I'm gonna guess flamers. Rip. All right, the next one's going to be flamers, though. That was chems? He actually has a chem unit? Okay, I'm, I'm surprised. I am surprised. All right, well. <laughs> chem unit a little slow on the old, the old double harvester into chem. A little slow for first missile. And of course, there's the temple. Why would you want to make any units except tech units? I'm just going to trap. I'm actually going to put a preemptive trap here. Comes the Widowmaker. Where's it going? Okay, I don't know where it's going. I'm just going to intercept it with a pit. Comes a second Widowmaker. Is he going for my harvester with a Widowmaker? What? He is. What? Why though? Alright, whatever. I don't even care, man. You can have my harvester. Except not really, because it's a Widowmaker, so it's never going to kill my harvester. And our trap paying dividends over here. Trap missile. He actually got the pit bull. Insane. Insane. Unreal. Jade OP. <laughs> Why is there a Widowmaker on my harvester? I wonder if my opponent is happy with his decision to put a Widowmaker on my harvester at this point in the game. Alright, there it is guys, 5-0 with the McBorker deck.
Um, I don't know about McNeil. I kind of think McNeil might just be a bit weak. Uh, I don't know, though. It's really hard to tell at the moment. It just... Yeah, it's just really difficult to tell what it does. Like, you make a trap and some stuff is slower, but it doesn't do anything in combat. So, like, it, obviously it can be relevant in combat, but a lot of time it just isn't. I don't know, man. I don't know. But there is a there is a McNeil Borker deck. This is uh, this is like an Agent Shadow style deck. He's been playing this deck. Um, I think that deck sucks. But there you go. That's just my opinion on the deck. He isn't playing it at the moment. Like, but yeah, I think the deck is real bad. I think Borker is pretty bad and Razorback's pretty bad at the moment. There it is. He's got a strong arm over here. Yeah, not a big fan of that deck. Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed that. I'll uh, the next one.